Hello, everybody. Happy Friday. Uh, look, AT&T is looking to buy Time Warner, not the Time Warner you're thinking of. This Time Warner owns HBO and Warner Brothers. Looks like they want to play in the content realm, if you will. Looking your way, Netflix. There are a lot of sharp elbows, a lot of money being tossed about. Time Warner shares at an all-time high today. So is Microsoft, actually, after a really good earnings report. And their play into the cloud computing space is playing well with investors as well. We're talking about 60 bucks a share. Again, all-time high. Sunday at noon, we do have a new show called Cultural Anthropology is coming up on the first two segments. We have a new ride-sharing app that has the backer of General Motors, big time. That's called Maven. And then we have How to Build a Spaceship or a Spaceship Company. There's an author of a book like that. And right now we have Mark Nieto, who has a podcast coming out pretty soon. And I'm, I'm sorry, mind your light. Yeah, get out of my, get out of my way. Yeah, we don't okay. need that either. All right. uh, presidential race coming up, obviously, next month. But... One of the biggest things that uh, you're going to be talking about on the election ballot is a lot of transportation measures, and we're going to have a lot of coverage on that on KGRRadio.com. My podcast pops today. Proposition R, Measure RR is uh, the big one for BART, so we'll talk all about that at uh, KGRRadio.com, and uh, we invite you to check it out. Hey, Mark, you cover traffic, right? I do cover traffic. Quick, quick question about this. Um, does the blinker actually turn the car when you're in traffic? Or do you actually have to turn the wheel? I just want to know. Because I, I, I think people are confused by that. <laughs> I think in the new Tesla model it will. <laughs>